managers uh, to form our opinion, and when we're done, we issue the report that appears on pages 14 through 16 of the Comprehensive Annual Financial Report. Uh, those of you that are, are continuing board members will, will note, if you can get through that report, that it looks a little different than prior years. Uh, the, the reporting standards were changed in an attempt to clarify specifically the roles of management in the preparation of the financial statements versus the role of the auditor in testing and determining the fairness of those financial statements. At any rate, uh, our opinion on the financial statements is unmodified, meaning that after we were done all of our work, our tests, our procedures, uh, we, we formed the opinion that, in fact, the financial statements are fairly presented, they are materially accurate, that the appropriate accounting principles were followed in their preparation, and those principles were applied consistently from year to year. Uh, in addition to that basic objective, uh, because the district receives a significant amount of state and federal dollars, uh, we also have to expand the scope of our audit to perform what's known in the jargon as a single audit. Uh, essentially, we have to uh, evaluate internal controls within the district on an entity-wide basis uh, and test for compliance with the variety of laws and regulations that the district must operate within. Then, we have to select uh, major grant programs, which are either large dollar volume grants or grants with tricky compliance requirements, and test those individual grants for controls over compliance and actual compliance. We issue two additional reports on those, which show up in the case section of the audit, starting on page 143. Uh, if you thought the opinion on the financial statements was tough sledding, <laughs> these next two are harder to read. And uh, I, I seriously think they are the cure for insomnia. Uh, but the key to it is, what, what are we saying in those reports? Uh, what we're saying in the reports is that we tested compliance. We found no reportable non-compliances. We evaluated internal controls. We tested internal controls to make sure that the controls that were supposed to be in place and working were, in fact, in place and working. We found no deficiencies in 